Hey, this is Doc Powell with Snowseekers here in Whistler, where we're just about to jump on the Black Home Gandhi behind us and go and catch up with one of Canada's most iconic, if not the iconic skier, that being Nancy Greenrain and this country's Olympic ambassador. She's going to introduce us to some new friends and talk a little bit about the legacy of what these games create. Then we're going to got a treat for you. We're going to dive into the Austrian house and go and get our ladle hosen on. Let's go uh, get up there and check out the action. It was a flame that traveled this country for over 106 days. Now it's moved onto the world stage within Vancouver and Whistler, British Columbia. Snowseekers, one of Canada's leading snow-minded new media companies, is here to light you up through our look at the 2010 Winter Games. Well, we're up here at the GMC Race Center, which is where people can, like these kids can go down a race course. Um, they're all in the ski school. And how many of you kids are from Whistler? How many of you are from Pemberton? How many of you from Birkin? And we have a girl from Korea, right? So we're gonna, I'm just gonna show them the race course a little bit and uh, have some fun with them. Well, the good thing about the Olympics is um, they're exciting to watch and they're, they're, you know, you're all cheering for your favorites and sometimes they're up and sometimes they're down. But um, to have the Olympics here in Canada is gonna be a real inspiration for kids like this. How many of you kids would like to go in a ski race? Yeah, see? So that's what it's all about. Nancy Greenrain's been a champion in Canadian ski race training for 40 years. Her ski league has put through almost 400,000 people through its doors. Her winter home is Sun Peaks Resort within British Columbia's interior. Sun Peaks is where the Austrian ski team comes to do their um, November training. And have you been over to the uh, Austrian house yet? Yeah, it's a very interesting house because it's uh, um, totally off the grid. It's uh, what they call a passive house uh, in terms of its energy consumption. It's really interesting. The Austria House here in Whistler is one of the premier destinations for the cultural houses and we step inside to take a look. Uh, the part is very good, it's uh, every day like, like today, every day. If we win or not win, when we win it's a little bit more, but it's all nearly the same. And some of the uh, waitresses and the servers, they're in uh, traditional Leidelhosen, no? The girls have dindles and uh, the boys have uh, leather trousers. What have you thought about this place? Ah, it's very beautiful here, really. The mountains, the, the woods. I'm feeling like I'm at home. And now I have to make this guy something to eat because he looks very hungry. 